Welcome to the Elective Rotation Podcast, Critical Care Pharmacy Minute, where I discuss one critical care pharmacy thought in about one minute. I'm Pharmacy Joe of PharmacyJoe.com. In this episode, I'll be discussing preventing injection site pain from etomidate. Etomidate is a non-barbiturate hypnotic agent that can be used for induction during endotracheal intubation procedures. It can cause injection site pain in as many as 60% of patients, with a third of patients reporting moderate to severe pain. Two regimens for preventing pain from atomidate injection have been shown effective in a randomized controlled trial. The first regimen is using 620 milligrams of IV magnesium sulfate diluted to 5 ml total volume with normal saline given IV push. Now this reduces the incidence of pain on injection from atomidate down to about 40%. The second regimen is 3 ml of 1% lidocaine diluted down to 5 ml total volume with normal saline, also give an IV push. And this reduces the incidence of pain on injection from etomidate to about 22%. If you're going to choose to use magnesium or lidocaine to prevent injection site pain from atomidate, they should be injected about three minutes prior to the atomidate administration, which is around the time that pre-oxygenation is occurring. And if you're using atomidate, that means your patient's going to end up on a ventilator. Download number six in my free download area is all about what a pharmacist should know about mechanical ventilation. To get immediate access to this and other useful downloads, go to pharmacyjoe.com free.